I'm Alex Ost Holman, and this is AU Fit Check. I would say I am a little bit of a sporty spice. I grew up with the Spice Girls, and I've always liked athleisure, but now that I can get away with wearing athleisure to nice things, it's really fun. I would say over time, it's just been about more like what I feel confident wearing and what makes me feel like my best self. My style off the field versus my play on the field is actually pretty similar. I'm a pretty energetic, positive, um, you know, happy player. But um, I always like to have some sort of like scrunchie in my hair. I'm a big bubble pony girl. I'm also not like the flashiest player, so I'm not gonna be in like a lot of colors and bright things. Um, I might have pops of color to make it fun, but yeah, I mean, I'm pretty much, I'm, yeah, I'm the same on the field and off the field. I really love Rocky Barnes. She is like one of my favorite influencers. She is super funky and eclectic, but also still has that like boho beach vibe to her. So I really love her. And then, I mean, me and everyone else in the world, I'm obsessed with Sophia Richie. So she's just so effortless and is kind of bringing back that a little bit more modest, um, you know, conservative style, which is really cool. Besides that, TikTok, I'm just trying to stay young. So today, my outfit is definitely inspired by Princess Diana. I just love her like effortless, chic, sporty, all of those like paparazzi pictures of her getting in and out of a limo. It's like just so cool to me and it's comfortable. So it kind of goes hand in hand with what I love. So gotta start with some biker shorts. Then the star of the show is gonna have to be the Athletes Unlimited crew neck, oversized, of course. I also love the like classic colors because I just feel like they're very like varsity, sporty. And then to dress it up a little bit, definitely gotta come in with my white Bellini cowboy boots because I just think they're a statement and they're so fun. It's kind of like that cool juxtaposition of like dressing something up um, with your shoe. I think that's the easiest way to do it. And then my Fendi, my vintage Fendi bag. This is like a dream of mine. I've been on the hunt for it for a long time. It's just cute and in the moment, but also like something 10 years from now will still be in style. And then my jewelry, my jewelry, it really is important to me. Um, obviously my engagement and wedding ring, and then um, my Cartier love ring I bought for myself. <laughs> I love myself. <laughs> on my 27th birthday, um, a lot of my jewelry stands for really important milestones in my career or in my life, and I just love kind of looking back on them. And then my two necklaces, this one at first is like a little charm necklace, which I'm a 90s baby, so charm bracelets were like all the rage. And so I have a number one for Marcus in here, um, a heart, an evil eye, a H for my last name, and then a little um, Italian horn. And then this one down here is a locket. It's like a little picture of my mom and my dad. I think everybody has like their own style and it's so cool to kind of see um, them express themselves off the field. You know, Mira always is dressed and she just is, has so much fun with what she's wearing. So it's really cool to kind of see that. I would say Izzy, Izzy McMahon has definitely got a lot of swag. She is someone that I always will text her. She's like my little cool sister. So I text her and be like, which hat should I get? Or like, which shoes are the kids rocking these days? Just to like keep me young. And then, yeah, I mean, my girl Sammy Jo, her and I are definitely risk takers in the in the lacrosse realm. So to me, it's like I love seeing people express themselves and feel confident in whatever they're wearing. So it's fun to kind of see like what that is or what that means to them. Thank you so much for watching, and this was AU Fit Check.